Hi, Chris Walls from Second Swing. We're at Bent Creek Golf Club today in Eden Prairie, Minnesota. We've got a beautiful Chris Fall morning here in the Twin Cities area. We're talking about new putters from Ping, the new Sigma 2 line. A lot of interesting technology going on from Ping, starting with adjustable shaft technology. This is really a neat thing that Ping's done. They've created a small tool that inserts into the top end of the grip that'll allow a player to adjust a putter length to any length between 32 and 36 inches. Ping found in its research that 80% of players are utilizing putters that are the wrong length. This is going to allow a golfer to take one of these putters out on the putting green, pick a head shape, a stroke type that fits their game, and then be able to self-fit the length to something that they're really comfortable with. And there's also some exciting technology going on with the face. We've got true roll technology incorporated into this line. What that is is that the milling pattern across the face varies in terms of depth and pitch to ensure that ball speeds are consistent regardless of your strike location. So if you hit a putt a little bit on the heel, hit a putt a little bit on the toe, you're going to get the same ball speed and get the same distance as if you struck it in the middle of the putter, which obviously is crucial when it comes to speed control. Additionally, these putters feature a new dual durometer insert. This is interesting technology because the insert the front layer is very soft, and what that's going to give you is a soft feel and impact and a lot of precision on short putts. And the back layer is a little bit firmer, which is going to give you a little bit of feedback and also help you on those longer putts get the ball to the hole. There's nine models in all available, ranging from blades to mid mallets to higher MOI mallets, including some brand new models. You've got the Valor, you've got the new fetch, which is an exciting option, allow players to pick the ball up off the green or out of the cup without bending over to get it. There's also a new Tyne 4, which is a winged mallet like the original Tyne, but it's going to have a, a neck design that's going to be catered to players with more arc in their stroke. These putters will also accommodate different stroke types, whether you're somebody who takes the club back, the putter back straight back and straight through, or if you've got a lot of arc or a little bit of arc in your stroke. I've had the chance to test these for the last couple of weeks, been really impressed. You know, the thing that's really stood out first and foremost is how well the ball gets rolling off the face immediately. And then in my opinion, the adjustable shaft technology is really going to be a great benefit to a lot of golfers. When you're struggling on the greens, a lot of times it's setup related. If your setup's not right, it's hard to get the ball started on the proper target line. To be able to get out there and really kind of fine tune these putters to get a length that you're really comfortable with is going to give you a lot of confidence. Confidence leads to making more putts and this is technology that can benefit a lot of players.